for in him every one of god's promises is a yes for this reason it is through him that we say the amen to the glory of god praise the lord a very good morning to you my dear brothers and sisters i pray for all those who are participating in this prayer service today we will earn a promise in word of god from the gospel of saint john chapter 14 verse 27 Let's claim this word of God for ourselves. The word of God says like this. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled and do not let them be afraid. My dear sisters and brothers, after the crucifixion of Jesus, the disciples fearing the Jews huddled in a locked room worried that they might face the same fate despite the closed door jesus aware of their presence endured amidst their suffering and fear saying peace be with you his intention was not to accuse for denial or betrayal but to console they rejoiced at the sight of jesus they found consolation today dear brothers and sisters amidst your suffering and sorrows jesus comes standing and saying my peace i give you don't worry it is not the fleeting peace of the world but an everlasting peace that no one or nothing can take away in the midst of your suffering Let us claim Jesus' promise of peace. Peace comes from trusting the promise of God in the middle of your storm. Let's claim this word of God. St. John chapter 14, verse 27. Let's offer ourselves and all the intentions of today. And we pray. Thank you, Jesus, for a new day. This is the day that you have made. and we will rejoice and be glad in it great is your faithfulness and your steadfast love o lord i give this day to you and ask that you use me however you see fit this day is yours everything that i am is yours be at my side and take control over the affairs of my life you are the god of the impossible and there is nothing you cannot do fight all my battles and make me victorious in all that i do use me as an instrument of your love and grace guide my thoughts words and actions and help me to be a source of kindness and encouragement to others may your holy spirit be my constant companion leading me in the path of righteousness All praise and glory to you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.